The tension on your AeroWorks tray accumulator requires regular maintenance. Depending on the model you have, tension is maintained either manually or automatically. The following are maintenance videos for both models. AeroWorks is introducing the new automatic take-up system on their tray accumulators. Uh, the tray system is shipped with these mounting brackets on it. That's for shipping purposes only. They need to be removed upon receiving of the equipment. They're just mounted with four bolts. The bolts get removed and then these brackets come off. Now the system is supplied with these six springs, which is putting constant pressure on the drive system. The drive system is no longer attached to the body of the conveyor, so the springs is pushing the system forward. So when you're using the system all the time, we always in the past had to do manual take-ups. When the chain stretches out, you would actually manually have to push the drive system forward. Now with this new system we've got, this will be done automatically. So as the train, chain stretches out during operation, the, the, the springs here will push on the drive system. This is completely separated from the rest of the body. This will actually automatically move forward. This will eliminate uh, jam ups and the necessity to do uh, chain take ups as well. Once this system is in place, you can run it and it runs free for the rest of the life of the conveyor. To adjust the chain, remove all side and top panels and note the overall measurements of the frame. All four sides must be of equal measurement. At the motor end, the frame is separate. Loosen all the quarter inch nuts for the chain guide hold downs on the underside of the upper angles. Now proceed to loosen the four half inch lock nuts holding the motor frame to the main frame. Now begin separating the frames equally by turning the nuts between the two frames until the chain is tight. The gap between the frames should be the same from top to bottom.